Hey all, Kurt Sasser here from TGT at Fan Expo Canada 2011. We're here with Lamin Martin, of course, of his amazing illustrations. How are you doing today, Lamin? I'm very good. How are you doing, Kurt? Not too bad. I got your name right this time around, so that's a good thing. <laughs> now, your artwork has been a true staple of, of what I remember about Fan Expo when it comes to not only your dragons, but your Star Wars characters and everything that you do. You have a true talent. Uh, but what brings you back to Fan Expo? Well, I decided to go with uh, more prints this year rather than uh, doing books because uh, I have a, a lot more print work or a lot more images that I created throughout the year and instead of trying to throw it all into a book and then having it uh, set on the table I figured just have a bunch of prints spread it all out so it looks more impressive and it's more vibrant more colorful and just attracts more people now I've been following you for a while on on Twitter I'm not stalking you obviously but uh, the one thing I did notice was you you've been in a few art shows as well how did those go well they went really well I did my uh, own art shows a couple times uh, uh, I did one in 2010 in December and it went really well. I had uh, two and a half foot by three and a half foot canvases, uh, 16 of them, uh, spread out across across the uh, walls of the venue that I was exhibiting at and uh, it was an amazing show. I got, sold some prints, uh, high-end prints, and met a lot of really cool people, sold some books as well as uh, regular 11 by 17 prints and um, it did well enough that I did another show in March of this year and then I have another show coming up in uh, October 7th, uh, uh, 7 to midnight at 587 College Street which is College in Bathurst. So if you want to see uh, an art show with two and a half foot by three and a half foot campuses of everything you see here, then show up. <laughs> and that's an endorsement in itself right there. Yeah. But what is it about Fan Expo that, that keeps you coming back? Though? Well, it's the, the amount of people here and you get to see really interesting creative uh, colleagues too. Um, I've been doing it for about six years now and um, I just see... Whoa... <laughs> That's, yeah, that's a colleague of mine. Ah. <laughs> so you get to see uh, interesting people like that guy, and uh, you get to you know talk with him, and network, and then see what people are doing throughout the year. Because it's sort of like a, I guess it's like a big Super Bowl for every anybody who's creative in the city. You know? <laughs> And in the country, for that matter, you get a lot of outside influence coming into it. It's great to see. Yeah. But, you know, once Fan Expo closes down, once you pack up, you head home, and, you know, you finally get to relax before your next show, yeah. what are you going to take away from this experience here? Well, it's obviously going to be the people that I met. I'm going to really get a, a hold of all the cars that I got together, and then just contact people, keep in touch, and see if we can work together on something. Who knows? Right? It's more about the contacts than anything. Of course, it's selling and making some money doing this but the contacts are really important too. And so at one of these uh, conventions, are we going to see a Lamin uh, Martin panel of some kind at one point in time? Do you think you could you could sway the uh, the fine artists out there to stop by? I wouldn't mind doing it. I've done panels like that before. Uh, it's just that I've never brought it up to anybody. I'm, I'm not the type of guy that says, hey, come talk to me. <laughs> but I have no problem doing it at all. It's, it's really fun actually doing panels. So if anybody's interested, I'm available. All right. Well, hey, we've got a lot of traffic here. We don't want to take up any more of your time, Lamin. It's been a true pleasure speaking with you. And best of luck. And when can we, where can we find your work as well online? At uh, www.laminmartin.com. Hey, thanks you very much for that. And I'll give Grace your time. Yeah, thanks a lot, Kurt.